everybody welcome to the 2 a.m. pipe on the patio and I am smoking the 320 with Lane Burley light without a bite thank you old pops for sending me that this may be my new favorite tobacco right here man I'm really enjoying this this is good really really good and not very aromatic, which I kind of like too. I mean, it doesn't smell bad. Doesn't it has you know a nice smell to it, but it's not like cherry or berry flavor or anything like that. It's got a it just tastes like a nice good tobacco. I am uh, absolutely in love with this pipe. I just, I try not to smoke it all the time because I want it to continue to be that joy every time I smoke it. And I've got a lot of other pipes that are, are really nice pipes and I enjoy smoking those. And so I try to go through, you know, at least a week before I smoke it. Man, I love this pipe. And, And I'm not smoking it with a filter. I'm smoking it unfiltered right now. And I don't notice a huge difference in draw between the filtered and the unfiltered. And this tobacco does not bite at all. So I'm feeling really good about just being unfiltered on this one. You know, I have s several pipes that I are my favorites. I mean, I, obviously, I have favorite pipes um, besides the one that I'm smoking on that day. But there are a couple. There's about four of my pipes that are just um, incredible pipes, incredible smoking pipes. This one is definitely my favorite. I will be eventually someday getting another one of these. Um, it's not, I'm not in a rush to go out and get any new pipes at this moment, but if I do, it'll be one of these again. And I wanted to show you this tamper that I'm using. This is one I found in a, a local thrift store. It was a couple of little antlers like this and it was tied together with two pieces of two two antlers tied together with a piece of leather and I don't know if it was for hitting together or what they did and used it for but I bought them and gave one to my nephew Tim to use as a tamper and then I used this one as a tamper and it it's just the perfect size it just fits right over my hand and just is perfect for tamping so when I don't have my little bullet that uh, I left my bullet in the house, so I use that one when I don't have my bullet from John Meadows. This one's actually been sitting in my pipe rack, just in one of the holes of my pipe rack, and I thought I'd bring it out tonight and use it because I haven't used it in so long, but. So do you guys have one of your pipes that, that is just your absolute favorite that you just love and it, you have to struggle not to smoke it all the time? Because <laughs> that's with this one, every time I look at it, I want to take it out and smoke it. And so every time I sit at my desk, I see this pipe and it's like, I want to go smoke that right now. But I uh, am trying to not smoke it all the time. It sure smokes good though. Let's 
So, uh, John, John Panzer told me that I had hit 600 subscribers to yesterday or today. I think it was yesterday he messaged me. It may have been early today. And I hadn't been paying attention. And so I was just blown away that I had hit 600. I need to do a GA. There will be a GA coming. It's going to take me a little bit to get it together. And I'm just going to slowly acquire the things I want to do for the GA. And then I will announce it. It'll be an easy one. It's just going to be a comment. I'm not going to make anybody do VRs or anything because there's enough of those going on and the, the feeds are plugged up with VRs for gauze. So I'm just going to do a just comment as long as you're a subscriber. And we will get you out the winning. So I'll stay tuned for that. That'll be coming up here probably within a month or so think that I'll start doing that but I hope everybody had a good weekend this weekend My wife and my daughter Sadie both go back to college tomorrow. They start back to school. And I have the day off. And uh, so uh, I'm going to try and do some work around the house here if I can get it done. And this is a great smoke here. The the, the 320, the Savinoli 320 with the lane burly light without a bite. Just a great, great smoke. Just a great combination. to thank uh, Cal Delta Piper who um, reached out to me last night said he was worried about me um, I'm, I'm doing okay I'll live but uh, I just want to thank Steve for that that was uh, very nice of him to do that So I will catch you guys later on. I'll probably do one more tonight about 2 o'clock. Right now it's not nearly 2 o'clock yet. Let's see what time it is. I'm not sure what time we're looking at here. So it's, it's only 7.30. So I got a whole night ahead of me here. Good times. Good times. You know, it's funny, I'm sitting here and I've got, if you saw the video before this that I just did, I uh, did a, um, got a couple of tobacco bombs. Um, and I'm smoking this and I'm smelling cherry. And I'm thinking, man, if I really ghosted this, did I smoke cherry in this? But it's the uh, Captain Black cherry that I got there. And I'm smelling out of the bag, coming through the bag. Well, Pops, thanks again, man. Uh, I really, really appreciate you sending me that burly light without a bite. And Briar Dude, again, thank you so much for the Sleepy Hollow. Sam, thank you for the two pounds of tobacco you sent me. Um, you guys are amazing, man. So I will talk to you guys later. See you later.